what is up y'all it's your girl if you welcome back to the channel so today's video we're going to be talking about why i stopped flat ironing my hair the whole thing is because my hair was basically damaged like it was completely damaged like it, my hair went from curly to wavy to straight wave straight you know it was like completely damaged i'm gonna put some pictures on the screen so y'all can see it you know it was it was thick at first but then as i keep flat ironing my hair consistently it completely damaged my whole hair like unhealthy you know fast forward to 2016 i was already in the army um you know when we were young we didn't even like we wasn't even stressed about anything you know, like adults life you know having your own stuff so i was basically under my mom's roof you feel me like <clears throat> back home and i wasn't even allowed to basically flat iron my hair my mom was like you know she's so hard on us so telling us like oh why do you have to flat iron your hair to go to school you know those type of stuff she was hard on me with plugging my eyebrows you know she called it cheeky like why are you plugging your eyebrows you're not even grown enough to do all of these stuff she was hard on me with like shaving my underarm or my legs you know she was like why are you doing all that those grown people stuff why are you doing it you're you're still young you know that's that you know and then she's the one basically stopping me from flat ironing my hair so fast forward to me joining the army you know i see the freedom you know i jumped straight into it and i was just like you know i got my stuff now i got my own money let me go ahead and buy me a straightener or let me go ahead and do whatever i need to do or you know to look different and stuff like that i was just so used to having a curly hair my whole life so let me go ahead and do my own thing ait i was flat ironing my hair i'm gonna post some some pictures on here so y'all can see i was like consistently flat ironing my hair and didn't even know it damages my hair you know ignorant i didn't even know you know what i'm saying so i went from flat ironing my hair every other week to every week it got really bad when i went to korea that was my first duty station korea and everybody that's in the army right now they know korea like you know we all lit every weekend so every weekend I always flat iron my hair because you know I want to look you know I look cute with flat iron like if I flat iron my hair and I want to look different you know a little bit different because like I said my whole life I always have curly hair so you know it got really bad to the point where my hair was super like it was long it was still long because I didn't cut it but it was not healthy and hopefully this video will like you know help some of you guys out there that are really trying to grow your hair and um, have that natural curly or natural healthy and full hair you know what i'm saying it, it, it was not just only flat ironing like we we are growing up you know we're go we're getting old you know what i'm saying back then when we was young we wasn't even worried about bills you know we wasn't even worried about grown people stuff we wasn't even worried about nothing but school you know it we it was no stress back then you know just school stress homework stress but then you know now i'm having my own stuff now i got bills to pay you know i got a whole relation i'm in a whole relationship you know like this stuff like that causes stress you know it basically like you know causes hair loss and stuff like that so keep that in mind you know so i cut flat ironing my hair 2017 was it 2017 or close to 2018 i think yeah 2017 was the last year i flat ironed my hair you know my husband really encouraged me like you know your hair is very healthy you know tr uh, you know you don't want to damage over damage your hair because now you see your old pictures compared to now it's really not the same no more so you know that's something you want to look into and then i you know i did my research and then i look it up I'm like, damn, this whole time, it was just, I didn't even know, you know what I'm saying? So for those of you guys that didn't know, heat damage is real and it's really bad for your hair. So, and then I basically completely cut it, like just cut flat iron my hair. I wrap it up. I think, I don't know if I threw away the flat iron or I just gave it to somebody. And then I did a cut. I cut my hair. I think I had my friend cut my hair for the first time after I left home. Y'all can see, y'all can kind of tell the picture my hair was wavy and then there's a the, the spot at the bottom it was straight you know that you can see it was damaged you know that's this that's the line where you want to cut your hair you know all the damaged hair all the split ends and everything it needs to be cut so yeah i did the cut and then that's when i started my healthy hair journey like i started like looking up stuff that i didn't even know about you know i started doing my hair more instead of being lazy and just flat iron my hair and just let it you know hang 
I basically did my research. That's when I see changes, you know, I kind of went back to kind of, you know, my hair kind of went back to when I was young, you know, have that full healthy hair, but it wasn't really going back to that, you know what I'm saying? Cause now, you know, we, like I said, we getting old, you know what I'm saying? Stress, damaging my hair. If I wanted to have a healthy hair, like restart everything, I would have to cut all of my hair off. And I didn't want to do that because I got a big head. Yeah, I basically just started my healthy hair journey. And then up until now, I still haven't touched any flat iron at all. Even if I use the hair dryer, blow dryer, I use the cold setting. I barely use blow dryer, barely. If I have to dry my hair out, it has to be air dry. I can't use no blow dry. You know, I can't use no flower. So everywhere, you, if you see me out somewhere, you're going to see my hair everywhere. Basically just air dry. If it's not every, like it's not air dry, you know, it's always in a bun. But yeah, I started, you know, just did my research, looking up stuff and hair products. I start changing hair products. And, you know, I went from using head and shoulders. Uh, what's the other one? Uh, su su Supreme. I forgot. Y'all know. I'm going to put it on the screen. Uh, Y'all know what I'm talking about. So I start, I, you know, I stopped using all of those products and start getting into like natural product. And now I'm completely like cutting off everything. And now I'm just using oil. You know, it's crazy because. I'm making my own product at the house. You know, it saves money too. That's going to be in a different video, but you know, I went from using all of these products to just minimize everything to just use natural product, like natural ingredients, ingredients for all my hair product right now. It's just crazy. You know, these are the stuff that you can actually do at home. Like if you do your research and look into it, like I'm telling y'all just start doing your own stuff to start looking up stuff, start doing your research. That's basically like, key points of this whole hair, healthy hair journey is to know what you put on your hair know your hair and know what you put on your hair you know you're the only one that knows your hair so keep that in mind um but yeah that's basically why i stopped flat ironing my hair it was you know it was kind of hard because i kind of like want to flat iron my hair just to see what i look like right now but i really can't because i don't want to go back to that if you really want your hair to be really thick and healthy i'm telling you I'm telling you, like, he is the most, this is the number one hair damage thing that you could ever do to your hair. Like, I'm serious. Um, you know, and then it comes down to what you put on your hair. You know, know your hair. Like, just know your stuff. Look at this stuff. Do your research and you'll be fine. Like, I'm serious. Thank you guys for watching. Um, yeah, I hope this video helped any of you guys out there. Like, seriously. That's, that's, I just want to share that with you guys. Um, cause a lot of people are like, you know, in the comment section, like Lofi, why you don't just straighten your hair? We want to see your hair straight, uh, all this stuff. But then I was like, you know what, what maybe, maybe if you guys get this video up to 1 million views, no, it maybe that's a maybe, maybe that's a maybe we're still going to put that maybe on it. So Hopefully this video will get out there to y'all. Like I really do wish this video will put like YouTube, please put my video on the algorithm and let people know. And hopefully somebody out there have the same story and they want to share with me. You know what I'm saying? Like all of these stuff really do play a good part in hair growth. I'm going to end this video right here. Make sure you guys, you guys already know. I'm not going to say it. You guys already know what to do. Anyways, end this video right here. Thank you guys for watching.